What did you make of the comments today from Janet Yellen and the market's reaction? Well, she missed one thing. She neglected to tell us that the Fed uh, is continuing on this unprecedented exercise in price control. Uh, Janet Yellen is meant to be more plain spoken than her predecessors, but a truly spontaneous expression of her intent would have been as follows. What we mean to do is to nationalize, continue to nationalize the yield curve. We want to make the federal funds rate a government rate, as we have, and we would like to enlist the stock market in a program of wealth for the security holders of America. That would be the essential program in plain English. Uh, the Fed has, in its 100-year past, manipulated interest rates before, but never until now um, has it treated the stock market as if it were a lever of national public policy, which it is doing. The Fed has its thumb on the scales of our finances. And certainly they would point to that and say, well, I'm sure in the back of their mind they think a higher stock market all moves. Right now oh, yes, they're they in place where it all moves in the same they direction, have, they right? They a, don't have to pick and choose. They have a $3 phrase. They call it the portfolio balance channel. It sounds ever so much better than right. manipulation. <laughs> <laughs> At the same time, you're talking about the benchmark rates that the Fed sets. We know that all debt trades on the open market. Yes, we know the Fed's a big player there. But the influence that they've had, uh, even going into last year when they still own a big portion yeah. of our debt, is clearly still overwhelmed by the broader impact of the market when people are worried, for example, that there's going to be a massive change in the taper or in the rate picture. So while it's clear that they are setting the price yeah. of the benchmark rate, the other rates still fluctuate according to where market participants see them and see the future. Well, it's a, it's a kind of a dance it's a, it's, or a duet. Uh, there is the market and there is the Fed. But as long as the Fed promises zero funding costs, what you find is credit spreads getting very tight. Uh, what you find is a, a great euphoria settling over almost all of the so-called risk credit markets, whether it's sovereign debt, uh, whether it's corporate credit, whether it's bank debt. Uh, there is a terrific, you know, there has been a terrific rally in the prices uh, of all of these securities. And the Fed doesn't, as you say, the Fed does not control them, but it heavily influences them all.